What's up everybody? Building a new quail enclosure. Got some quail from Pondoms. I got them in a real big temporary that would have been plenty big enough, but go big or go home. So putting up chicken wire. Figured I'd show everybody how, an easy way to do it. You don't have to use horseshoe staples or whatever they're called. Fencing staples. Let's go around this one. I've already went along, stapled the top, leave everything else loose all the way around. And at this point is when I realized I probably should make a quick video. Ponham thinks that people would want to watch my building videos, but he's full of crap sometimes. You guys, check out Ponham's Outdoors. But she see she's loose. I usually take it just in random spots along the bottom here with my thumb, push down as hard as I can. Staple. You can see she's pretty tight. And I, I'll go along here, hit it in random spots every so many feet, probably a foot or so. See, she's real nice and tight. It doesn't look very good if you're. If your fencing is wavy, so just go along, pull down, get your, get it the way you like it. And then I go through, once I do that, I'll go through and hit it a bunch of times. And most people, understand why I got this hanging over. I'll come through here and I'll put dirt and that'll help keep stuff from digging because they'll usually start right here. They don't start digging back here. So leave a little bit of excess out on the bottom. Try to prevent digging anyway. All right. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Whoa, hang on. I gotta show you the staples I'm using. Just a quarter inch crown staple. You can pick these up for like 20 bucks at Menards. So, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, appreciate it.